Oh yeah, we're live. We're live. And it's an Arizona Saturday night. An Arizona Saturday night, baby. And I'm sitting in my hammock because that's just what I do. <laughs> it's an Arizona Saturday night. It's an Arizona Saturday night. We hit 79 degrees. My phone says it hit 81, but I... I think it was 79, but it was warm. It's the weather's getting real nice. Spring is here. Summer's coming real soon. It's an Arizona Saturday night, baby. All right, I'm here. I'm here in my hammock. Okay, I got my hot dog shirt on. See, there's my hot dog shirt. I have a new item. Do you see it? Right there. Right there, you see it. It is my prickly pear cactus lamp. I've got a new lamp. It's a prickly pear cactus. And um, so I'm gonna turn it on in a little while. All right, hello to all three people watching. Please comment, please say hello, just say hi, okay? We're, I'm just hanging out in my hammock on a Saturday night. Let's just talk about whatever, you know? Talk about life or life stuff. You know, and I, for the thumbnail, I, I uh, can't grab it here. Here it is. For the thumbnail, I brought my, I put my Green Valley postcard in the thumbnail. That's where I live. Green Valley, Arizona. Lots of different cactuses on there. Oh, yeah. So, all right. <laughs> it's a little too dark almost. But, hey, it's an Arizona Saturday night. Hey, Orla. Orla, how are you? Where are you located? Are you in Arizona? Is it Saturday night where you're at? Hey, Peter, not too shabby. Hey, Peter. Everyone, I'm here. I'm just sitting in my hammock. All right, there's a big light up there. And uh, I bought my prickly pear cactus mat, uh, lamp. Right there, baby. I did a not too shabby of it. Here, I'll show you. Let me get my phone here. Let's see here. Okay, I gotta pull up my page here. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Orla, you're Irish? Orla, that's so amazing. Hey, I'm gonna be celebrating St. Patrick's Day in a in uh whenever, like in a few weeks. We Americans go crazy over St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, yeah. Did you see last year? Last year I did a live stream where we were going crazy about St. Patrick's Day. Totally going nuts about it. Celebrating the Irish, Irish culture, green shamrocks, dancing leprechauns with big red beards and, you know, drinking green beer. <laughs> hey, Ultra. Hey, Sam the King. Hey, Daniel. Daniel, that's so wonderful. You keep saying not too shabby. Sam the King, you're welcome. Sam. <laughs> All right, Sam, I'm just going to tell you right now. I have another postcard for you. I just got to go to the post office and mail it. I already signed the back. <laughs> your, your, your address, I already filled it out. I just have to go to the post office. So I don't know how many postcards you've gotten, but this one is going to come at some point, okay? <laughs> it says Green Valley, all right? So I've been surprising you with the postcard now and then. So, But here's one. I'm just showing everybody. It's a nice-looking postcard. It's not too shabby. So... <laughs> <laughs> oh, really, Sam the King? Yeah, yeah, Sam. That's great, man. Sam, it's fun sending you postcards, man. <laughs> okay, so by the way, there's my prickly pear lamp right there. I'm going to turn it on. It's not on right now. Here, here's the, here's the um, not too shabby I did of it. It's a prickly pear lamp. Not too shabby. <laughs> Isn't that cool? It's a prickly pear lamp. Yeah, 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 you got it. <laughs> Sam, you don't have my address. I'll have to send you my address. But don't feel like you have to reciprocate, though. 
or you know it's all right to send me a postcard but you don't have to at all but and it's kind of fun to like like sending something in the mail is like the very it's so contrary to our internet world where you just send emails or social media to actually send something a piece of paper you know what i mean it's kind of fun so anyway hey by the way um all right i made two not too shabbies today all right the prickly pear lamp right there and then also i was sitting in my uh in my bedroom there's a ceiling fan and i was like that's actually that's been not too shabby it's a ceiling fan not too shabby hey ryan hey ryan hey buddy hey buddy hey say hi to ryan orla gareth and rachel am i saying gareth correctly hello to all my irish friends in ireland oh you're in liverpool that's that's a, for the uk that's not a shabby city liverpool it's not too shabby hey yeah ryan orla gareth and rachel you guys are awesome Seriously, I'm celebrating St. Patrick's Day again. I go crazy over it. It's an amazing holiday. So we celebrate all things Irish. All right. That's what we Americans do. We make fools of ourselves. So. <laughs> all right. So everyone, I'm here in my hammock. I love my hammock. I already did a not too shabby of this hammock, by the way. So it's really lovely. So. And then. There's the dark sky out there. All right, there's the dark sky. I think it's what, like 6.30? It's 6.42 p.m. in Arizona. All right, so it's it's starting to, it's getting pretty dark now. All right, so in the UK, what time is it in the UK? It's seven hours? Was it like, is it one in the morning? What time is it in London, England? In London, England, it's 1.42 a.m. Hey, hey, I have Irish Siri. Everybody, I, the, like, she's, she's an Irish woman. I picked an Irish woman. Here, watch, watch. What is 562 minus 17? The answer is 545. See, she's Irish. She's Irish. I have an Irish Siri. Is that amazing? Orla, or hey, Dejan, hey, Nate, hey, buddy, hey, Nate. Nate, I watch your shorts, buddy. Keep up the good work. It's one of these days, you're just going to explode with your shorts. Everybody, go check out Nate's, uh, Nate's channel and subscribe to him. He makes these shorts, and he's like me. He's trying to be funny, you know. <laughs> he's a little funnier than me. But go check out Nate's page, all right? Yeah, yeah. Seriously, I'm so excited. Yeah. Really? So, by the way, for my European friends, I have a T-shirt on. Okay, I'm wearing shorts. Okay, I don't even have socks on. Okay. Because, I mean, in uh, I'm in southern Arizona. I'm in the southwestern corner of America. In fact, the Mexico border is about 40 miles pretty much behind you, you know? Um, and uh, today in Fahrenheit, the temperature was uh, 79. It says we got to 80. Okay, right right now it's, look, I'll just do it in Celsius. I'll just change everything to Celsius for my Europeans. We hit 27. 27 was our high today. And right now it's 20. It's 20 degrees in Green Valley. Okay, it's not too shabby. Right now in London, it's eight. And I have a friend in Norway that lives in Trondheim. Trondheim, Norway, and it's two. So where I live in like my home in Westcliff, Colorado, right now it's a negative three Celsius. So this is all in Celsius, right? I got to do that for my European friends. I don't do the metric system. I don't do the metric system. But I will do Celsius because I got to, you know, I got to be flexible. <laughs> yeah, no, Orla, it's really nice. I'm wearing a t-shirt. I don't even, I could be, I could, I, I could take off this shirt too. 
That would be kind of obscene, though. But <laughs> hey, I give. I. What does everyone think of my hot dog shirt? See my hot dog shirt. It's like a a man and girl hot dog, and they're hugging each other or something. So it's like a hot dog drive-in kind of thing. Or here, I did a not too shabby of this. Here, let me just start playing some hot, some uh, not too shabbies. Hot dog, not too shabby. All right, let's see. Here, here's my hot dog, not too shabby. It's my hot dog t-shirt. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Hey, I actually have more hot dog themed. Let me just play some hot dog themed uh, not too shabbies here. It's a Sonoran hot dog sign. Not too shabby. <laughs> They're pretty good, those Sonoran hot dogs. Wait, I got more. Ooh, ooh, here's one. Look at that. It's a neon sign. Here. It's a neon lighted hot dog. Not too shabby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, Josh, wake up. Josh, wake up. Okay, how was that? <laughs> okay, I'm just, I, I was responding to somebody in chat. Oh, look, I have, here's a Maxwell, a dog. It's Maxwell, a cute pug. Not too shabby. Yeah, yeah. Oh, neat, neat. Where do you live? Neat, are you in California? Is that where you're in? You're in California. It's 78 degrees. Okay, so you're in Southern Cal. That's pretty cool. Take care, Sam the King. Say, take care. And Ryan, yeah, I'm, I, I, I haven't done too much today. All I did was, um, ooh, ooh, I got a moth flying on me. Okay, that was like scary. <laughs> the only thing I did today was I bought that prickly pear lamp. Let me turn it on. Here, look at this. Ready? Isn't that lovely? My prickly pear lamp. And it's got those little, it's got like those little red, they're supposed to be fruits. Those things up there, that's supposed to be fruits. So it's a prickly pear lamp. I'm gonna keep it on. Isn't that lovely? It's very, uh, a Mexican family makes these a Mexican family and the woman, the woman here in Tubac, it's a, like a Southwestern decor, Mexican decor kind of place. And the woman said that there's a, a like a family in Guadalajara that makes these lamps and they make them by hand. And it's kind of like made out of like a, I guess, aluminum. It's like a thin metal and they make these prickly pear lamps and then they ship them. And, and, um, so, <laughs> I love it, man. So that's going home with me to Colorado in May when I finally get home. So anyway, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got it, yeah. Hey, he woke up, Ryan, or like the guy woke up. Oh my gosh, that's so great. So Liverpool, UK, that's amazing. I just wanna show you, by the way, let me just play this. I have one British, not too shabby. Okay. One true British, not too shabby. Here it is. All right. Right here. It's a British police hat. It's a British police hat. Not too shabby. There you go. <laughs> Dejan, I don't know if I have a favorite saguaro of the day. I, I just make them, man. I just make them. They're, it's a weird, it's not, there's something about the video series. They're not really catching on that much, you know, but I try. I, I just do them just to get myself out. It forces me to get out of the house. 
You know what I mean? It gets my creative juices because every day I've got to go out and find a Solaro and make a little video. So I don't know that I, so, but anyway, maybe that's a lame answer. So, all right, Nate, you're in South Florida. That's awesome. You're near Miami. That's freaking awesome, man. Dude, you need to make, make more videos of palm trees. Just do like videos of palm trees or something. You know, I would watch like, really. I don't know. It's just my dumb idea, but you should do like, just show what it's like out there in Miami, you know? So, hey, board. Yeah, yeah. I got my hammock. I got my prickly pear. I also have a, I don't know if you can see it, but I've got a hummingbird feeder out there. So sometimes the hummingbirds come out. You know, it's pretty nice, man. It's pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, Nate. Nate, like I'm a I'm a I'm one of those like annoying tourists. I'm a snowbird. I live in Colorado, but I come down south. I come to Arizona for the winters. All right. So I'm one of those people that goes south for the winter and then I go back up, you know, for the summer. So like if I was in Florida, I'd just be going batshit crazy. I've got all the, you know, all the palm trees and the beaches and orange trees, all that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? So <laughs> and I'm just talking. I'm just talking. <laughs> So how's every, how is everyone's weekend going? All right. By the way, I think I titled this, Let's Talk About Life. Like, let's talk about life as I sit. And, you know, we can talk about serious stuff or whatever, you know. So we don't, like, usually the topic is, is about my not too shabbies. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, you guys. So really, it's 1.40, it's 1.50 a.m. in the United Kingdom. That's pretty late. Oh, really, Nate? All right, I'll check out some of your South. I'll check out your shorts. I've only watched your recent ones. I'll have to watch them. I saw the ones where you were making fun of uh, the Detroit Lions. You know, so I kind of thought you were from Detroit or something. So <laughs> anyway, you got to come out to Colorado, come out to Colorado in the summer. In the summer, the weather is so nice in Colorado. It's like in the eighties. It's just, it's not that hot, at least if in the mountains and then there's no humidity, you know what I mean? It's really dry. So it's, it's just lovely. So anyway, I'm trying to like, how's my hair look? How does my hair look? I got issues with my hair today. Very trouble. My hair is on the shabby side. It's looking shabby. Jeez, man. Getting a whole bunch of grays. Whole bunch of grays on the sides here. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, it's pretty shabby. So <laughs> look at that prickly pear light. It's actually called a luminaria light, a luminaria lamp. Like in the Southwest, it's actually acceptable to just put a, like for Christmas, it's an acceptable Christmas decoration to take a candle, you, you put it in a brown lunch bag, and it like it kind of glows the whole bag. And people do that. And that's like a Christmas light. You know what I mean? So it has the same, this is actually called a luminaria lamp right there. So. You know, anyhow, the next thing there, right next to this, when I bought this, there was a Spanish Christmas tree, or at least, I don't know if it's like more Central American or Mexican, but it's like all silver. It's like a silver aluminum tree and it just looks, it just looks so wonderful. I might get that too. So Oh, the muddy. Okay, you've been to Evergreen, Colorado. That's pretty cool. Evergreen, that's kind of just, that's outside of uh, Denver. So that's pretty cool. 
That's pretty cool. So. <laughs> hey, to all six people watching. By the way, if there is, if you do have a favorite not too shabby video, let me know. What, what's your favorite not too shabby? I'll play it for you. And I'll tell you the backstory of it if there is one. Okay. Like, let me just play some more. I'll just find some more not too shabbies. Let's see here. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, here's one. It's three bicyclists and a support vehicle going out with me for a while. Not too shabby! <laughs> I was biking across America, and my friend Coleman and his daughter and two, two friends, they biked with me for about 20 miles as I was leaving Abilene, Texas. And biking east. So on that trip, Nate, on my third bike across America trip, I started in San Diego and I biked to Florida. I went halfway down Florida. I finished at the Cape Canaveral seashore area. So Cape Canaveral seashore, New Smyrna Beach is where I biked to. And then I, we went down another 10 or 15 miles. So it took me uh, seven and a half weeks to you know go across the country so what do you think about that it's not too shabby Dejan actually this is this is only my third winter where I've done this the first two years I was staying in motel sixes I was just finding cheap motels or some Airbnbs where I would stay for a week or two weeks and I work remotely. As long as I have internet, I can work. So for this is the first time where I got a room rental. And my roommate's a really great guy. His name's Steve as well. And um, he had a spare bedroom. And uh, so I'm just doing a room rental. And I've got my own bedroom. And we get along. He's a good guy. He's funny. He's laid back. So, so I'm totally settled in Green Valley for, you know, until May 1st. So it's pretty nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's not even, it's not even, he's charging, it's reasonable what he's charging me. So, because the thing I've noticed is, uh, especially this year, motels and hotels, they've gone way up. And when I first got down here, I was a little shocked. I was like, oh, my gosh, everything's just pricey. And I was like, I want to stay in Tucson, but everything's pricey. And I was on Craigslist trying to find a room rental, and and, and I found one. So I'm really happy. So, But the two previous winters, it is more fun, though, to be like one week here, two weeks there. And, like, I was driving. I spent, like, three weeks. Last winter, I spent, like, four weeks in El Paso. Two weeks in Deming, New Mexico, like a month in Tucson, a week in Yuma, two weeks in uh, Gila Bend, Arizona. You know, I was just bouncing around all these little southwestern towns. So it was pretty neat. So there's more fun to kind of like traveling and exploring. But this winter, I just wanted to settle a little more. So because I, I might want to buy a house in Green Valley. But uh, we'll, we'll see if I do. We'll see if I do. So, yeah. So that's 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 my thing here. You know, let me find some Arizona not too shabbies. Right here, baby. Arizona not too shabby. Oh, there I am. There I am. <laughs> All right. Here's a, here's what came up. All right. Arizona print scene. It's an Arizona print scene. Not too shabby. That was a few days ago. Oh, fuck. Here, here. It's full colors in Arizona. Not too shabby. <laughs> All right, what else we got? Oh, oh. 
it's a Southern Arizona vacation guide. Not too shabby! I squeaked. My voice squeaked in that one. Oh, my gosh. Oh, hey, hey, there's a town called Y. It's Y, Arizona. Not too shabby! <laughs> I say that one weird, too. Oh, here, here. It's pretty Arizona scenery. Not too shabby. <laughs> Here, Winkleman, Arizona. It's Winkleman, Arizona. Not too shabby. Yeah, Nate, Nate. Nate, you lived in Tennessee? Hey, I think I got a Tennessee. Hold on a second. I've got so many not too shabbies. Tennessee. Hey, I got something. Look at that. Let's play it. It's a Tennessee license plate. <laughs> not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Tennessee license plate. There you go, people. Oh, wait, 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 wait. My friend Joey visited me. Here, here. It's a Tennessee flag hat. <laughs> Not too shabby. I did it with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, I got everything, man. <laughs> Whatever the topic is, I probably have a not too shabby about that topic. So, oh, wait, wait, I got one more, but it's actually... All right, it's it's a it's in Colorado, but you'll see. It's Tennessee Pass. Tennessee Pass. Elevation 10,424 feet. Not too shabby. <laughs> Those are all my Tennessee not too shabbies, all right? So <laughs> Hey, Dejan, I don't know. It was like 10 years ago. I started saying not too shabby, and it just stuck. And then I started making videos about it, you know? <laughs> hey, Corna. Hey, Corna, check out my, my prickly pear cactus lamp. Welcome to my live stream. I'm sitting here in my hammock. I've got this lighted prickly pear. It's so lovely. I, I'm in love with it. I really, I'm, that's, I, yeah, that's going in my living room somewhere. And uh, even the table's nice. I bought that table last week. It's like got a, t it's made of like tile. See, it's got like little tiles, tile pieces. See, there you go. You can see that. So it's kind of green. It has kind of a Southwestern look to it. So, and then it has like another, you can put stuff on the bottom there too. So, and I'm into buying, I'm such a nerd. I buy Southwestern like decor and furniture and stuff like that. So, anyway, yeah, yeah. Hey, Alexa, how are you? Yeah, yeah. I love that lamp so much that I, I made a video expressing what I thought of it. And here, here's, here it is. It's a prickly pear lamp. Not too shabby. <laughs> Nate, take care of yourself, buddy. Oh, you're at work right now? Nate, take care. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. Seriously, I know you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Seriously, it's nice chatting with you. Sorry you're working. So don't work too hard or anything, all right? So I'm just being lazy here in my hammock, so... So make it not a shabby night, okay? So, all right. And uh, to all my friends, let's do a water. It's a toast, but water, a water toast in a Powerade bottle, but it's just water. Here, here, to you, all my friends, all my friends on YouTube, you're awesome. Oh, you got it, man. You got it. You got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
All right. So how's everyone doing? Let's talk about you. Tell me one whatever noteworthy or interesting thing that happened in your day. All right. What, what's, what's going, what happened in your life today? Who needs encouragement? You know, who needs encouragement? Come on, people. I'm a, I'm a therapist by trade. I'm a mental health therapist. I sit around and I talk to people through my laptop and I try to encourage them. I listen to them, you know, um, I try to, you know, help them any way I can. It's like, how can I encourage you? You know? <laughs> oh, Alexa, you had a and W. What did you have? Did you have a burger? Did you have a root beer float? I don't know how I feel about root beer floats. I actually, actually, I had an ice cream cone at Dairy Queen. My face is like fatter because I've been eating like a lot of food lately. I can tell my face is like a little fatter. But anyway, I had an ice cream, a dipped ice cream cone at uh, at Dairy Queen. So, <laughs> oh, you're vegetarian, Alexa. Wow. Hey, Alexa, let me see. I think I've got some vegetable not too shabbies here. Let's see. Vegetable not too shabby. Let's see what I got here. Well, actually, I typed in vegetable not too shabby and it it gave me these autumn gourds. I guess that's a vegetable. Here. It's an array of autumn gourds and squashes. Squash. Not too shabby. Squash. Squash is a vegetable, right? Squash is a vegetable. Let me find another one. Well, there's ramen noodles. Ramen noodles. Here. Cooking ramen noodles. What happened here? Wait. What happened? What the heck happened? I don't know what happened to that one. Hearty soup. Heating can soup. <laughs> Not too shabby. It's picking up all my food, not too shabby. Heating hey. can soup. Oh, watermelon. Watermelon. Here, here. That's a, fr I think that's a fruit. It's not a vegetable. It's a watermelon in the fridge. Not too shabby. <laughs> all these food, not too shabby. Oh, butternut squash. Butternut squash, right here. It's butternut squash tortilla chips. Not too shabby. <laughs> there you go. Oh, look, look, my lamp. My lamp. It's showing my lamp. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> Yeah, I remember that butternut squash. The butternut squash chips were good. All right, I got to plug in my phone. My phone is dying. My phone needs some juice here. Let's see. Stick it in here. I've got an iPhone 12. Is it gone? Come on. Let's see, maybe I'll put it on this end. There we go, it's charging. Is it going? Hey, Rotator. Hey, Rotator, how are you? How are you? I'm here. I'm here doing a live stream from my hammock.
Hey, buddy, Colin. Yeah, yeah. Colin, I make these not too shabby videos. Which not too shabby were you watching? I'm just kind of curious. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I'm sitting outside. I'm in Arizona where it's really warm. I'm wearing a t-shirt. It's nice. And uh, I'm doing a live stream with my friends. And everyone, please click like, you know, and let's, let's just talk. Let's just talk about whatever. I'm kind of curious which one. Oh, it gets fuzzy. Oh, Colin, the county courthouse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll play that for you. That was from Reddit in 2015. It was October 2015. My YouTube page exploded because I, I got way high on the uh, on Reddit because somebody posted this video. And they were like, here's a dude who just makes not too shabby videos. And here it is. Here's the video. Play. Play. Come on, YouTube. It's the Los Animas County Courthouse. House. Not too shabby. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Not from Reddit. Really, Colin? <laughs> Oh, you guys, that's the most watched not too shabby video. It's been watched 158,000 times. So, and I was just, I, I was living in Trinidad, Colorado. Go look it up. Trinidad, Colorado. It's near the New Mexico state line, Southern Colorado. And I was just biking around and I, I was, I was, I was biking by the courthouse and I was just taking a rest. And I thought, you know what? The courthouse is not too shabby. It's the Los Animas County Courthouse. Not too shabby. From there, it just, you know what I mean? It's exploded. So. <laughs> so there you go, people. There you go, people. How about that? How about that? So. By the way, I'm trying to check the. Uh, my internet connection got a little fuzzy there. Um, so hopefully it won't go out or anything too much, but all right. He's all right. First of all, Alexa, do any of my clients watch my video? Yeah. A few of my clients, my counselor, I once in a while, I drop my YouTube channel and I'm like, Hey, go check out my channel, you know? Not too much, but once in a while. Some sometimes I do. Some of them watch my Waro the Day videos and all that. So hey, Colin. Okay, first of all, I will play the the very first not too shabby. All right. But for, the first thing I want to just say is if you go into uh if you go on YouTube and you just type in first not too shabby, first not too shabby video. There's a video called the first and like it's I go to the place where I made the first not too shabby video ever in Salida, Colorado. And it's like a three or four minute video where I show everything and, you know, talking about the history, the history. OK, so anyway, but I'll play the very first not too shabby. Right here. Let's see, where is it here? Here it is. It's 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 actually a long, it's 14 seconds, which is it's really long compared to the average not too shabby. This is the Arkansas River. Not too shabby. <laughs> I look younger. I look younger in that picture. So <laughs> Yeah, Colin, where do you live? Where are you located? I'm kind of curious. Like, are you in Colorado or Arizona? I'm just kind of curious. So, 
Yeah, Z, I love the hammock too, man. I love the hammock. It's real nice, man. It's real nice. So. <laughs> uh, oh, you're at Penn State? Get the heck out of here. You're a student at Penn State University? That's That's amazing. What are you studying there, man? Colin, you're more interesting than I am. You should be doing a live stream. What are you studying there? Do you go crazy at uh, football games for the Nitt Nittany Lions and paint your face the school colors and go, you know, nuts? Penn State. I grew up in New Jersey, so I, I'm I'm acquainted with the Northeast and all that. So, and I got out as quick as I could. <laughs> Yeah, so <laughs> anyway, ah, oh, you guys, man, I don't know. Ah, <laughs> oh, guys, how many people are left watching? How many people are watching? Let me see here. It says seven people are watching, but then on my end, it says two people. I actually have a window open in another window, like where I'm watching my live stream and it says there's seven people watching. So anyway, cause like sometimes I want to go and see what you're watching because occasionally there's a problem. Anyway, Colin, you bought a house in Cape May. That's so cool, man. That's cool. I grew I grew up in northern New Jersey. I had a good childhood and I'm thankful. But like I, I just wasn't a fan of New Jersey once I became an adult and I moved west. And I pretty much ended up in Colorado for a long, long time. And now I split time between Colorado and Arizona. So but Cape May is nice. Wildwood is nice. We used to do family vacations when I was a kid. We'd go to Wildwood. We'd go to Seaside Heights. A um, couple of times I went to Cape May. I think when I was like in college. So, Colin, I'm in the Arizona area. I'm in Tucson or Green Valley. It's like 25 miles, 20, 22 miles south of Tucson. So, but the Tucson, the Tucson area. Where all the beautiful saguaros are. The saguaro cactus. So beautiful. You know, I'm into the cactuses. Here, I'm just going to type. Saguaro. Here, I'll just, I'm just going to show you pictures. Let me just see here. Find some pictures. There's a nice looking saguaro. Look at it. Cactus tree. You know, but it's thorny. It's thorny. You don't want to be hugging it or messing with it. By the way, for those of you who've never... <laughs> Colin, I have a license plate. This is my license plate. And too shabby. <laughs> and too shabby. What do you think of that? And B. Pretty much by Mount Lemon. Mount Lemon is north of Tucson. Yeah. Yeah, Dejan, you took the ferry from Cape May and from traveling to Virginia to connect. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. You know, that's an interest. I need to explore Delaware, the Delaware Beach. I haven't really explored the beach south of like in Delaware or the Maryland shore. Or the Virginia show. Like, it'd be pretty interesting to kind of go out there. Yeah, Alexa. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's so awesome. Let me just show you more pictures of the of saguaros. Let me see. Oh, here's something. 
This is an organ pipe cactus. It's called an organ pipe cactus. Look at that thing. In America, they only grow in the south, like far southwestern Arizona. This is a really common cactus throughout northern Mexico in the desert. And then there's one little section where they grow naturally. And it's called Organ Pipe Cactus National Monument. The amazing. It's such an amazing uh, cactus right there. Is that pretty cool? So he lived in Virginia Beach 11 years. That's pretty cool. Wow. Pretty cool. Neat. That's neat. Colin, you got to come out to Arizona, man. Look at these cactuses. Is that beautiful? That's so pretty. Hopefully my connection here is getting a little fuzzy. Let's see here. Hopefully my connection. I'm sorry if my connection's no good. So let me see here. Then at Christmas time, some people take their saguaros and they put lights around them. And for the holidays, they put lights around the saguaros. Isn't that amazing? Look at that, people. Isn't that amazing? Oh, my gosh. Let me see. What is this? Here's like a common <laughs> All right. Are we still on? Are we still on? Okay, we're still on. We're just kind of, it's a little laggy. So let's see, what else can I show you? Here's a pretty, here's another picture of, of like Choyas. It's a, a cactus desert scene with the sky. Isn't that beautiful? I don't know. You guys, I'm, I'm a nerd. I'm just into nature and the desert and these cactuses. Or, I don't know why. I was reading like it's beauty and danger put together. That's what the desert and cactuses is all about. Beauty and danger. So hold on, let me turn this on. This is all about beauty and danger. So hold on, let me turn this off. There you go. It's real pretty. Anyway, I'm just showing you pictures. So Corna, how are you? How are things? I gotta charge my phone a little bit here. So, so many pictures. Oh, this, like a mile away from my home, there's a guy who's got this magnificent saguaro. And look at all those arms. Isn't that wild? Look at all those arms. <laughs> so crazy. Hey, Dejan, this is one of my favorite saguaros of the day was this one. And actually, the guy came out, the guy that was living in the home, he came out and he, you know, I was just, he, he, he you know, because of the, the uniqueness of this saguaro, he, he knew exactly what I was doing. I was just looking at it, taking pictures, and he started talking to me. And he's a nice guy. So anyhow, yeah, man. So anyway, that's an interesting saguaro. So <laughs> Tim, it sure is a nice night for a, uh, a hammock. No doubt about it. So and I got this uh, prickly pear lamp right there. Is that nice? The prickly pear lamp. So. We're going to Arizona the night away. That's what I say. Arizona the night away. It's an Arizona Saturday night. And Green Valley. This is a, on the thumbnail. This is a little postcard. So right here, baby. It's just a little postcard. <laughs> so there you go. Woo, who's watching this Super Bowl? Who are you? Who will you be cheering for in the Super Bowl tomorrow? 
the Rams or Cincinnati? Personally, I'm for Cincinnati. I don't really care that much. Like, it really, these teams, I love NFL football. But I don't strongly dislike, you know, if the Rams win, I'll be happy. Von Miller was a Bronco. And so, you know, like Von B Niners. And I got to cheer for Cincinnati. So, but it, hopefully it'll be a good game. So, hey, Orla, you're back. What is it? Like two, it's almost 2.30 in the morning in Liverpool. Oh, my gosh. Orla, do you make videos? Do you have videos of, of like your life in Liverpool? Man, I'd love to watch videos of like, you know, British things and just even the fact that you drive on the wrong side of the road. I would love to just see cars on the left, like, you know, driving like maniacs on the wrong side of the road. I would love to see that, you know? So, <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh my gosh. If I actually visited the UK, I'd be so scared to sit in a car where we're driving on the left side of the road. That would freak me out. <laughs> yeah, Ryan, thank you, buddy. Ryan, I really appreciate that. Holy cow, what a compliment. I really appreciate that. Thank you, buddy. Oh, my gosh. Hey, Ryan, you're right. Hey, hey, I've got Irish not-too-shabbies. Let me just play that, okay? Want Irish? I'll give you Irish, okay? First of all, I have an Ireland mug. I have this mug at home called, and it's... It's a little sheep. Isn't that cool? Here. It's an Ireland mug. Not too shabby. See, and it's got a little sheep. All right. Is that that's pretty cool? And then last year during St. Patrick's Not Day. Oh <laughs> All right. And then here is I was wearing it here. It just speaks for itself. It's my Irish bow on St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> Not too shabby. I was just super happy. Yeah, yeah. You want I think Irish. Those are the only two Irish ones I've got. All right. So yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, wow, wow. Everyone's commenting and saying nice things. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Tim, yeah, people drive a little crazy in Denver for sure. Yeah. There you go. I'm trying to think, like, if I have other... Now, most of my... I want to see if I have any other European... Not too shabby. I've never been to Europe, but let's see. It's trying to pick up like, oh, a German Volkswagen bug here. But it was in America, though. It's a beautiful beige Volkswagen bug. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's not too shabby. Isn't that nice? Corna, you're so kind. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Hobby. Wait, what is this? Wait, I think I've got a German. I think I did like a German chocolate cake. Let me just type in German, not too shabby. Oh, no, no, no. There's just the Bavarian restaurant. That's like a German thing, but this was in America. I guess they serve German food or something. It's the Bavarian. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. 
There you go. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, you guys. Orla, you should do not, you should do live streams in Liverpool with, and like have like, have like, if you live in a terrace house or one of those like apartments with a window overlooking the street, have it so that the street's in the background so you can see the cars driving on the wrong side of the road. You know what I mean? In Liverpool, like that would be really cool. And then just have a live stream where you just talk, you know? So, by the way, I think, um, just want to be clear. I have Irish Siri. You know how you can pick for your iPhone? You can pick like a man or a woman, different types of accents. You can pick like an Australian person. Uh, I guess you would call an American person. I think a British one. And then I picked the Irish woman. So here, watch. What is 755? Divided by nine. That would be about 83.8888. Yeah, Irish Siri. Isn't she the greatest? Yeah, yeah. How do you spell Dublin, Ireland? Dublin. D U. B L I N Dublin. There you go. So, really, you got an American Siri? Why would you want an American Siri? I want, I like, like, I'm sure that, I, like, my Irish Siri, I call her Irene because I know it's a very Irish name. You know what I mean? Irene. So <laughs> she's the greatest. So, <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> oh, you guys, <laughs> oh, you guys, man, what are we going to do? By the way, it's dark now. It's 7 30 PM. And here's the, here it is black you can see how black it is out there see there's just that one light there that's kind of annoying but it's black so there you go <sighs> you guys hey wait 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 your name's irish or Orla. Is Orla Irish? I love Orla. That's a great name. I could name a so have you been seeing my Sawaro the Day videos? I could name a Sawaro Orla. That'd be pretty cool. What's a typical favorite day? Right now, a typical favorite day is I get a workout at my CrossFit gym, which is Amazing. It's kicking my butt. I go to the gym. I come back. I shower. <laughs> then I head over to the Dunkin' Donuts and I get a Dunkin' Donuts coffee. I get a decaf coffee. I do my saguaro of the day. It's a nice warm day. It's like 20 in Celsius. It's like 25 to 27. Okay. Which is like in the seventies or low eighties down here. And uh, I like my work, so if I work, I don't mind working a little bit, but not too much. <laughs> and uh, make a few not-too-shabbies, upload them onto YouTube, and we're good, man. Sit in the hammock. I'm a really simple guy. So, yeah, yeah. Ryan and Orla. Okay, okay, that's awesome. Yeah, hey, Pomp. Hey psycho, psycho! I live in Green Alley. I'm twenty. I'm twenty miles south of Tucson. Yeah, Tucson's a nice. I love. I love the whole area, Tucson. But yeah, pump, pump. Every day I find a saguaro. Do a saguaro of the day video. You know what I mean? 
they're really not that interesting videos, but I try to try to be funny, try to, you know, say, yeah, yeah. Or I turned 50 in September. I'm 50 years old. What do you think about that? 50. Oh my gosh. You want fun, Steve Fax? I was born in 1971. Holy cow. So, Psycho, where, did, where do you live now? You moved out of Tucson? Where are you? Where are you living now? Hopefully, you're, I'm kind of I'm sad you, got, you had to leave Tucson. So, I don't know what fun facts. Fun Steve facts. Yeah, I made a prickly pair of lamps. Look at that lamp. It's not amazing. Man, I love that lamp so much. Man, I'm <laughs> and I'm into hammocks. <laughs> so I have. Hey, you want a fun Steve fact? I have biked. I've ridden my bicycle across America three times. Two thousand eight, seventeen. Three times I've started in California at the beach where the, the Pacific Ocean and I've biked across my continent to the east, to the Atlantic Ocean. So, and you can see pictures here. I'll, I'll actually send you, uh, here, I'll send you, I'll send you my journal with all my photos, bicycletrip.net. Just sent, put a link in the chat section. Uh, that's my, you can see my photos from my 2017 bike across America trip. And it was like 2,700 miles, somewhere around there over seven weeks. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. <coughs> Arthur. Hey buddy. Arthur, how are you doing, man? Hey, you're, you're like a new Reddit friend from that, uh, deep into the YouTube Read it. It's a, it's a journal with photos, and, but like it took me 53 days to bike across the country, my country, and each day has its own photos with stories about what happened. And I had videos every day. I made videos of things that happened. So, yeah, 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 man, that's so great, Arthur. So, all right, you guys, I'm getting tired. I want to keep going and doing my live stream, but I'm getting tired. I got to pick off. <laughs> so, all right, let me get some water here. All right. Oh, get this. I should take a nap. I should take a nap. I, I did a live stream. I, I did it. I tried to take a nap during my live stream. And people were downvoting my live stream. So it didn't work out. So. <laughs> So I thought about doing a live stream where I just totally s sleep and I just have the camera on me. That's good. It might be kind of weird, but it was an idea. Sometimes you just got to try an idea. You know what I mean? So anyway, so <sighs> Orla, what's one Orla and Ryan, what's one fact about you? Yeah, what's one fun fact about each of you? Alexa, Arthur, Ryan, Orla. Give me one fun fact. You know, Psycho, or if you're still around. So, doing all right. <laughs> all right, here we go. My neighbors are here. So, 
Hey, Steve. Hey, Rusty. Nice night for you to smell like that. Yeah, it's nice. It's really nice. I, I like to put up the light up there like that, too. That's really cool. Yeah, I'm showing my friends. I'm talking to a couple of my friends. But, yeah, it's like a, I bought that today, my prickly pear lamp. Yeah, I really like that. So. Yeah, it's perfect for that, too. Yeah, I'm going to bring it. I'm Yeah, I'm not going to keep it out here. But oh, okay. for tonight, I just, yeah, I just bought it. Okay. Great. So. It really looks nice. Yeah, well, thank you. I'm into the southwestern stuff. I am. Are you? Yeah, we bought all these old uh, Indian, young all on the walk and stuff because I'm a western buff. You know, so. Yeah, yeah. But that's why I am. <laughs> all right. Well, you have a good night. Have a good night Sleep too. well. So. Yeah, yeah. I was talking to my neighbor. My neighbors were camp out there, so they're nice people right there across the hall. So, yeah, yeah. So, Alexa, you're a vegetarian. Why are you a vegetarian? I want to know why you're a vegetarian. Why did you choose to? I'd love to hear that. So, oh, you so long distance for three years. Oh my gosh. Wow. Arthur, I don't know. It's kind of just confusing, but I started just to see things about 10 years ago and I would start saying, hey, that's not too shabby. Oh yeah, that's not too shabby. And then I was like, why not just make a video and then turn and do the not, and that's how it all started. <laughs> Yeah, everyone check out Orla's video. Um, Orla, okay, after this live stream, when it's all done, then YouTube will allow me to go back and click your name and go to your, so I'll check out your channel too. What kind of videos do you make? No, I know, I know. There's some ethical issues I with uh, meat and how... Animals are raised and that whole thing. I hear you on that. I hear you on that. So I just don't like vegetables. I struggle. I struggle with that. So. Orla, do you do live streams? Do any of you do live streams? I think you should try to do a live stream. You might have some fun. Just try it. This is an idea. So, I'm not really a vegetable person. I'm sorry. Hey, I eat green beans. Is green beans, is that a fruit? Is that a bean or is that a vegetable? I do eat green beans and I do eat a lot of fruit. I eat pears, peaches, bananas. So, that's pretty good, right? So, <laughs> I do eat fruit. I do eat fruit. Look, look, look. I've got here. I mean, I think I have not. I can answer that with not too shabbies. Let's see. Fruits is the least. Oh, here, here. Well, here. Here we go. Come on. It's a can of peaches. Not too shabby. See, peaches. I usually eat canned stuff because if it's raw fruit, I'm too allergic to a lot of fruits. But Oh, here's another one. It's a can of peach slices. Not too shabby. <laughs> that is so bad. That is so bad. You know what I mean? I think I've got pears. I think I have one where, let's see here. Pears. Oh, it's pull, pulling up all these prickly pear cactus. Hey, at home, I have a purple metal prickly pear cactus right here. Here it is. It's a purple metal prickly pear cactus. Not too shabby. 
Isn't that lovely? What do you think about that? Two thousand, Arthur, you're gonna watch all two thousand four hundred seventy-four videos, dude. That's gonna take hours. It's gonna take like three or four hours. You realize how long it's gonna be to watch all those videos? Holy crap! That's a lot of videos to watch. Alexa, there's something about raw fruit where it's, I don't know if it's in the skin, but if you bite it, if I bite into it like a peach or like an apple, I'll get like, sometimes I'll get an allergic reaction and it just makes it not fun to eat. I don't know if it's in the skin or whatever, but then like if it's canned, I never have a problem with allergies, you know? And I try to like, try to pick the one where it's like really reduced sugar because it doesn't have to be sweetened much at all really you know so arthur that's crazy you're gonna have a not too shabby marathon yeah ryan you like the fast ones hey you want really fast ones i'll give you some fast ones here here's some of the fastest not too shabbies okay let's see here Here, <laughs> look at that thumbnail. I look mad. Look, it says three seconds. Here. All right, here we go. It's an Ocotillo, not too shabby. <laughs> there you go. It's a fast one. Oh, my gosh. Here, wait, I got more. Jessica. I got one where it was just, let's see. Here we go, baby. This one. It's Jessica's pet grooming, not too shabby. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I got more. This one was really fast. Ready? Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> Here we go. It's so fast. Red chair, not too shabby. Play. Red, not too shabby. <laughs> Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> Ocotillo. Classic speedy delivery. Wait, let me play this at 20. I can reduce it to 25% speed. All right, this is, so it's. Slowing it down a little bit, at least. Here we go. Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I also have a pumpkin. The the all shortest, not too shabby, is like one second. It's one colon o oh, two, so it's one second two hundredths. All right, here. This one. A pumpkin, not too shabby. <laughs> A pumpkin, not too shabby. <laughs> That's this is the fastest one. <laughs> My friend's kids uh, are behind. Play. It's slow. Like A pumpkin, not too shabby. A pumpkin, not too shabby. <laughs> All right, let me play that at the. 25% again. Let's see here. Pumpkin, not too shabby. Here we go. Not too shabby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Arthur, I got to come to Brazil. I do. I got to get out of America. I got to get out of America. The not too shabby cannon. I do like the Ocotillo, the classic speedy delivery. Yeah, the not too shabby, classic, speedy. 
<laughs> oh, you guys, man. It's not too shabby. So many not too shabbies, you know? Here's like a inflatable pumpkin right here. Oh, it's fun. It's a big pumpkin balloon. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Slow-mo shabby. Oh. <laughs> so many not too shabbies. A pumpkin empanada. Here's a pumpkin. <laughs> a, a, nothing is. Sh yeah, yeah. Ryan. Take care. It's like three in the morning. Dude, it's three in the morning. You should be in bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. Did Josh ever wake up? Wake his ass up. Come on, Josh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, take care, Orla. Uh, everyone, go check out Only Orla's uh, YouTube channel and subscribe to her. I'm going to play this just for you. All right. This might not be the most appropriate because it might give you nightmares, but it's still, it's a great one. It's a toy snake. <laughs> the toys. Have a good night. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, you got it. Yeah, yeah. Josh is asleep on the sofa. Yeah, well, it's three in the morning, so you can't be too hard on him. You know, but hey, we're going to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. I hope to do another live stream. We're going to celebrate it. And and then, like, I always have British British people that get jealous because we're celebrating St. Patrick and Irish things and green shit. And they get all jealous. Last year, my British friends got all jealous. And I had to be like, hey, knock it off. You know, every day I make a big deal about the British and. British accents and all that. Just for one day, we celebrate the Irish, you know? Go find the leprechaun and follow it to the end of the rainbow. You know, St. Patrick's Day, drinking green beer. It's, a, it's amazing. So, <laughs> all right. Oh, you guys. I, by the way, I really recommend a hammock in the rain. Sort of like a, it looks like a banana. Okay, there's the front and then there's the back. And it's just like one frame holding, you know, a frame on, like sort of like a banana shaped and it holds each end. So I really recommend this, this uh, single frame hammock. It's like I can hide. Here, I'll like bring you in with me inside the hammock. Almost totally. Yeah, there we go. Isn't this nice? Inside the hammock. Oh, yeah. It's not too shabby. So there you go. You know, it's really impressive that I had people in Liverpool, England, watching my live stream at 3 in the morning. And then there's Americans where they don't have an excuse. It's, you know, it's almost 8 o'clock in the evening. We're all my American friends. <laughs> I'm sure it's probably it. So anyway, so it's been a fun live stream though. It's been fun. I've got my lamp. That's the big highlight, that lamp. And then my postcard, my Green Valley, Arizona postcard. I, I live here in the winter. Green Valley, Arizona. Oh, yeah, baby. Come visit. All right. So, all right. With regret, I'm going to have to go. I'm going to go. I'm sorry. But I got to cook some food. I got to have some dinner. All right. So, hey, make it a great dessert. I appreciate all of you. All right. And... All of you are not too shabby. 
at all. All right. Arthur, I'm sorry. I got to go, man. I'm sorry. Alexa. Yeah. I'm probably going to make some pasta, Alexa. But anyway, make it a great day in the desert.